I found five high paying certifications that you can use to land entry level remote jobs that are hiring right now. And considering these certifications only take a few weeks or a few months to get, and they are significantly more affordable than something like a college degree or going to a boot camp, these can be an incredibly good option for a lot of people out there. So if you appreciate me doing these types of videos, let me know by gently tapping that like button. And let's jump into it with number one on the list, which is going to be the Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate. Now, by the way, all these certificates will be linked in the description and the pinned comment below if you want to check them out. But yeah, this is hosted on the website Coursera. There's been over 2 million people that have enrolled in the course and have taken it. So it's really proven at this point. And it's basically designed to fast track your career in data analytics. Now, they say it takes about four months to complete, but most people that self-report say that they can complete it much faster than that. And you're going to learn a ton of valuable skills. I'll put them up on the screen. You can pause the video and check them out if you'd like. Now, some jobs that you might go into after getting the certificate would be a data entry operator. They make about forty to $57,000 a year. You might also become a data analyst. They make about eighty six dollars to $137,000 a year. And if you progress in your career, you might become a senior data analyst and they make about $132,000 to $196,000 a year. Now, if you think that you can't get a job with just a certificate, you actually can. For instance, this person here is a hiring manager and they say it's possible to get a job with just the Google Data Analyst Certificate. They say, however, it heavily depends on the pool of applicants. So it is possible to get a job with just a certificate, but chances are you also want to get other certificates and then you also want to work on your portfolio. But overall, people say really, really good things about this certificate. So yeah, overall, really, really good. I'll put it down in the description and the pinned comment below. Another really good one is the Google Project Management Professional Certificate. This one's already had 1.5 million people take it, so it's proven. It also has tons of reviews and comments all over social media from YouTube to Reddit to on Coursera itself. And they say it takes about six months to finish at 10 hours a week. Of course, you're probably going to finish it much faster than that, usually somewhere between one to three months. It has some really good skills that you can gain. I'll put them up on the screen. You can check them out. And there are many different career paths you can go into with this. For instance, project managers make about $102,000 to $181,000 a year. And senior project managers make about $129,000 to $199,000 a year. And then chief project managers make $231,000 to $400,000 thousand dollars a year. Now at this one, it's a really good certificate on its own, but you're likely going to have to take some other certificates as well. So the PMP, for instance, is a really popular project management certificate that you'd likely take. Also, it would help if you built up your portfolio, did some projects and showed that you have some good experience. And there's a lot of people online that have said that this certificate has helped them to land a job. So yeah, another really good one, especially if you want to become a project manager. Typically, you wouldn't become a project manager right off the bat. This is one where you already have a job maybe as a customer service representative or something like that and you want to shift into project management. But you do see people becoming project managers right out of college, so it is possible. And again, you can check these out with the link down in the description and the pinned comment below. I believe you can audit some of these courses for free, but if you want to actually get the certification, you do have to pay Coursera. And I think it's only about $49 a month and sometimes they might have some location-based discounts. Next is going to be the Salesforce Sales Development Representative Professional Certificate. Now this one is a little more rare, only about 37,000 people have enrolled, but I really like it. Now, this one is also found on Coursera, and it basically helps you to become a software sales representative. Now, it says it takes about three months to complete at about 10 hours per week. And like I said many times before, usually these are way longer than what it actually takes. This one will probably take a few weeks. You do learn quite a bit with this. I'll put it up on the screen. You can check it out. And software sales representatives make $131,000 to $232,000 a year. So this is really, really good money. And then software sales managers make $181,000 to $328,000 a year. And then software sales directors make $200,000 to $438,000 a year. So yeah, I really like this one. I really think it helps. Salesforce is a very common CRM that is used in many different companies. So it does make you look really good, especially if the company you're applying for uses Salesforce, right? So yeah, really good one. I like it a lot. Next is going to be the Google UX Design Professional Certificate. This one has a million people already enrolled. So it's been tested. A lot of people have gone through it. So this one, of course, would help you get into UX design, which stands for user experience design design, but it also goes over some UI features as well, which is user interface. And it says it takes six months to finish at 10 hours a week. Chances are you can finish it around two to three months, maybe even a little bit less than that. And entry level UX designers make about 61 to $98,000 a year. UX designers in general make about 89 to $160,000 a year. And senior UX designers make 150 to $242,000 a year. So yeah, really good stuff. This one has some phenomenal reviews online. Lots of people saying good stuff about it on Reddit. Of course, with UX design, just having a certificate is definitely not going to be enough because it's an artistic type of career. So you have to have a portfolio.
portfolio. You have to showcase your designs, right? So building a portfolio is going to be incredibly important. Now with this certificate, they do help you to build a portfolio, but you're going to want to do more outside of the cert. But with that being said, really good one. Absolutely love it. Next one on the list is going to be the Google Digital Marketing and E-Commerce Professional Certificate. Now this one has about 652,000 people that have done it and it has a really good rating. And it says it takes about six months to get through it, 10 hours a week. Chances are this one you can get through in like a month probably. And it's going to help you learn digital marketing and it's going to teach you a lot about e-commerce because there's a lot of digital marketing jobs in e-commerce. So digital content coordinator would be one career path you might go into. That's about 45 to $74,000 a year. Another career path would be a digital marketing manager. That's later on down the line. They make about 92 to $167,000 a year. And then another career path would be director of digital marketing. They make about 143 to $250,000 a year. So yeah, really good stuff. A lot of good career paths to go into. Very important skill to learn, uh, whether you want to be an employee or whether you want to start your own business down the line, or you could even become a freelancer. So it's extremely flexible. You can do so many different things in the career of digital marketing. If you haven't checked it out already, I did a video on 11 high paying certifications that can help you land jobs. It got over 500,000 views and you can check it out by clicking right here.